hello guys good morning um it's actually afternoon it's like 3 30 <laughs> um but this morning i went to bed at 2 a.m because i wanted to well i edited two videos i filmed one i was cleaning and then i ended up just going to bed at two. Oh yeah and then i also got my lashes done last night um oh i need to brush this one but i only got like a semi fill so i'm gonna do the rest today or tomorrow but um my sister's lash tech which is just bonuses here and then i bought hair dye so i'm so excited i'm gonna feel like a whole new person in a few days anywho uh stayed up late and i slept a little bit in this morning because as you guys know leslie's at my sister's house and she's coming back in a little bit but i'm gonna do my makeup and my hair and be a human i already worked out this morning um showered ate breakfast the whole nine yards and it's thursday no, it's not. It is Friday. So it is Good Friday. And Easter's right around the corner. So I'm gonna. Oh, yeah. And this morning, as soon as I woke up, I started working on thumbnails. Wow, my hair is crazy. So it was a very productive day. So I just got to upload two videos today. And then edit this vlog tonight. But it's been such a good day. Such a good past 18 hours. Um, 12 hours. However long it's been, though, Leslie. But, anyways, I'm gonna get ready for the day before leslie comes home and then just spend a lot of time with her oh and i also did more of leslie's easter stuff last night getting things ready so i don't want to do it tomorrow night but i still do some stuff like the bunny footprint and all that jazz anywho you guys probably watching this with kids so all okay, right so my makeup is done and i just fixed my hair so i'm gonna upload the video before leslie gets home because she's on her way right now okay, so we're gonna make hello fresh again tonight so, let's figure out what we need to do all this. Space, you can have your own set of wings. With your feet on the ground, you're a bird in flight. With your fist holding tight to the string of your kite. Krispy Kreme lineup. Just you know, the, yeah, the usual. There's probably I don't know, maybe a hundred cars. No, that might be steep. Maybe more than fifty. That. I would say more than that. Mm. Sir, sir, you're in my way. It's up and down every, every aisle. Every. There's probably fifty. I doubt it. We should ask the bounty hunters. <laughs> So, I would say we're a quarter way through the line, waiting for half an hour so far, and there's still definitely 50 cars ahead of us. Still, but we're committed to this line. There's been a lot of people that have ditched, but we're committed. The Donut Queen is committed to getting four dozen donuts. We've been here for what an hour and a half, almost two hours. So we're thinking about leaving, and then I'll just have to come back tomorrow. All day. Okay, so we've been in this line for what two hours, two and a half hours. Yeah, two and a half hours. We're almost there, guys. We're probably like twenty cars away at this point. We're laughing about it at this point. Everyone's getting tired, but we're an hour easy. <laughs> no yeah. But we're all just I'm laughing at it at this point until he's back to cuddling with me. <laughs> but that's to work in the morning, and it's already almost eleven. <laughs> okay, so we finally made it. Two and a half hours later, almost three. But we see people ordering five dozen donuts like we are. So that is a positive, and they have lots of them open. The it covered by green yeah you guys can see that yeah all of those are still probably full so that's good we're ordering five dozen donuts okay so yeah the spring oh my <laughs> the spring donuts and five dozen donuts <laughs> we waited we're gonna guess we waited almost three hours for donuts and they still have lots left 10 minutes shy Which of three hours so round up <laughs> <laughs> but um hopefully they're all super fresh and delicious it was super quick after i ordered 50 dollars later lots of donuts 
I'm happy donut queen, but we'll all be tired tomorrow and full of sugar. Okay, guys, so real talk quick. Yes, we went to Krispy Kreme and it took three hours and it was past bedtime and it was late and there was a lot going on. And then I came home and just, just weren't done from dinner because we didn't expect to be that long and just garbage didn't happen and cleaning didn't happen and everything just kind of turned into a big blur and then I had to get Leslie to bed and although she fell asleep in the car but then she like woke up because it was cold outside and da 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 da. The moral of the story here is the reason why we actually went to Krispy Kreme and I actually vlogged this a few weeks ago but I deleted it because I felt like maybe it wasn't the right time to share and we didn't really have the answers but my neighbor actually two weeks ago um I think I don't know roughly it was one of the first few days of my vlogs she her husband called the ambulance for her to go to the hospital because she couldn't she wasn't like she had no concept of the time she was sleeping a lot she couldn't really move and it just wasn't good so she went to the hospital and found out that she has brain cancer so they took the tumor out of her brain but unfortunately we found out that it was a little bit too late and that she still does have cancer but since this whole situation she um after a few days of her being able to kind of like walk and talk a little bit um they sent her home so that she could be with her husband because she doesn't have that much long to live um she's such a nice woman and she's just she's just so sweet and her husband is um he last summer he had last summer the summer before that he had to get his leg amputated so he no longer has just above his knee it's no longer there and they've been through a lot over the past few years but um she doesn't have that long to live anymore but d due to this whole hospitals are filled and um so they kind of just sent her home to live out her days um she's not really in pain she says but she's not really talking all that much um 10 years ago she actually had breast cancer so it's just it's been a, a lot but her favorite thing is Krispy Kreme donuts so I ended up getting her a dozen donuts and I'm gonna bring those over to her tomorrow um I'm just gonna put them on like a little TV tray outside of her door and then knock on the door for her, well, her husband to come to the door and get them. But yeah, so it's been really, really hard and that's why it was so important for us to go with Krispy Kreme because she came home today. Um, and she has a nurse coming eight hours a day and then coming back to help her get ready for bed because obviously her husband's also in a wheelchair so that's really hard for him. Um, but yeah, so that's why I don't want you guys just to think we went out to Krispy Kreme for three hours for nothing during a pandemic. I feel like there's so much information that I've left out in telling you guys this. I just told you it's like the quick rough summary, but even they don't know all the answers. They don't know how long um, because there's just not enough doctors and nurses and they're just not spending as much time on her case because of the but yeah so I got her donuts so I'm gonna give those to you, give those to her tomorrow and I'll let you guys know how she reacts because she's just the sweetest woman but I'm gonna have a donut take off makeup and go to bed so hope you guys enjoyed this vlog I know it was short and sweet but yeah I love you guys and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow bye